Hey guys, I'm not sure how many of you saw my Ebola video from this morning. Um, it's just, it's been flagged as inappropriate and spam, which is totally pathetic. Um, what my video was about was there was a story in the mirror today saying that, um, no, actually it was Saturday, saying that a woman had come off a plane from Sierra Leone and she'd dropped dead from Ebola. Um, they hadn't even tested the woman to see she had Ebola and they hadn't even, the symptoms, the signs weren't there that she had Ebola. Um, it's just scare tactics here, just, you know, it's distraction and it's scare tactics and there's probably going to be a vaccine on the way for Ebola and then even more problems after you've had the vaccine. And I don't want anyone to get me wrong here, I'm not saying that Ebola itself isn't something that exists and I know that people have died from it in Africa, but I'm not too sure about the statistics we get and the facts they tell us about Ebola. Now, the person who flagged my video, I find really sad and just to... Um, you know, validate what I did in that video. I actually got a message from somebody who comes from Sierra, Sierra Leone and they have thanked me for what I said in that video. So that to me is proof that there's something going on. You know, um, you can't just say that someone's died from a disease if there are no, there's no proof there. That is lying. That is, that's reporting a lie. The Daily Mirror, you're, you're disgusting because that was just a blatant lie. The woman was not showing the symptoms and she was, she was not, she showed no symptoms at all on a five hour flight. And if you know about Ebola, it takes a few days to progress to the point where you then start to bleed. You know, there's different stages that you have to go in. You're not going to just get sick and then die from Ebola on a five hour flight. Okay, that's disgusting. And that's, that's fake news. That is not fake news. And like I said in my last video, distraction, it's distraction again. Plus, I'm sure there's going to be some crazy ass vaccines coming for it. But this is just to say again that I, um, I'm i not saying that it doesn't exist. And to any families who have suffered this, then I'm, you know, my condolences for your loss. But the woman who died in England did not have Ebola. So the mainstream media have no right to be fear mongering, like fear mongering as they are by telling us that this woman there was a Gatwick alert and an Ebola alert. So what I'm going to do is I'll put the link below so you can read it there. But to the person who flagged me, do you know what? My channel has constantly got flags on it. Constantly. So for the last three, four years, I've constantly had a flag on my, on my channel. The thing is, it makes no difference to me and I still run my channel. I can still put my little videos up and I can still get information out there. So um, to the person who flagged me, have a great day. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this video as well. So big love to you. Peace out.